Hi guys, Todd again with TW Home Show. Thanks for joining me again on my channel. If you're a subscriber, I thank you very much. If you're not, please hit the subscribe button. You're gonna like my videos and want to see even more of them in the future. So today I'm doing a uh, review video of the Chic Soap Dispenser. This is uh, for a wall mount in your shower. And I had one of these uh, probably about five years ago in one of our last homes. And since we moved a couple times, uh, I never got around to trying one of these again. Now this one is a little bit more upscale than we had before. And that's why I chose it. Um, it holds, it says it's a 16.9 ounce unit. And when you open it up, you'll get, you know, a welcome card, nice touch, uh, your soap dispenser accessories. Let's see what's in here. This is actually the mounting screws. If you want to screw it into your tile, uh, if you're brave enough, I'm not going to do that this time around. Uh, it's got some labels on it to label your soap. And it's also got uh, silicone glue in here and double-sided sticky tape. And that's how we're going to be mounting mine. And we'll take a look at the actual unit. It's got kind of a brushed metal look, but it is plastic. It's pretty stylish. Two compartments here. So you can have like your uh, conditioner and your uh, shampoo. In my case, I'm gonna have, I don't use conditioner, so I'm gonna put in shampoo on one side and uh, uh, shower gel on the other side. And I got two of these units as well. So I've got a dual shower head system in our uh, shower. One I'm going to go on one side and one on the other for my wife so that uh, we'll have less bottles uh, hanging around on our shelf in the shower. I'm trying to clean that up. I'm kind of on an organizational kick around my house. Uh, if you haven't seen them, uh, check out my kitchen videos. I'll leave the link above. But uh, stay tuned. I'm going to get these mounted and uh, see how they do. Now when you do mount these, you're going to have to let it sit, the mounting bracket with your silicone overnight for 24 hours before you actually uh, uh, install the uh, unit. Let's see how this thing, okay, this thing opens like this. And these bottles, these come right out. So easy to fill, it's got a little cap on the top. So when you're mounting this, you're gonna wanna take the bottles out and just mount this plastic unit. It's lightweight. And then wait till that silicone dries. And in my case, I'm going to uh, take an extra step. You don't have to, it doesn't say you have to in the instructions, but I'm actually gonna drill holes through here in the back so that the silicone has something to uh, grab onto and keep it uh, held up there for a long time. Here's my shower. Uh, I've got a head right here and a head right here. And I'm going to mount one of those units right on the side wall here, right next to this shower head over here. And then the same goes for this one. I'm going to mount it to the side wall right here. So I'm going to clean these surfaces up right now. I recommend you use uh, like alcohol and some pads or uh, towels or whatever and get everything, all that grime and soap off of the tile so that the silicone will adhere. All right, so I'm gonna prepare my surface. Stay tuned. All right, so use your rubbing alcohol, some paper towels, and let's clean that surface. Then you're going to take your two-sided sticky tape and just stick them on there in a few places. Mainly down the middle is where they're going to fit because uh, they're pretty wide, they're pretty cut. 
and then you're gonna to wanna to put your silicone. Notice how I drilled some holes. I don't know if you can see those holes, they're kind of small, but it's just something that that silicone can seep into and dry to give it some uh, vertical stability. And uh, so that's how I'm gonna mount mine. Let me get the silicone. Next, your silicone goes on. Now I haven't peeled off the back side of the two-sided tape yet. I'm gonna do that next. If you get some big blobs on there in a few places, that's always good. And that's about it. I've used the whole tube. All right, now we'll peel off our tape. And we'll make our placement here. I don't want it to be too high. My wife's kind of short, uh, but it's out of the way. It's gonna be a flat surface. I'm gonna go up here near the edge, just so that I can eyeball it. Make sure it's level. Uh, the ideal thing would be to have a level, but I can easily tell that this is level right here. And just firmly press into place. There we have it, guys. I'm gonna hang the other one up and then we'll come back in 24 hours, fill it up, and see how these things pump out uh, our, our soap. All right, guys, uh, we've waited the 24 hours for our silicone to dry. It's up there nice and tight. As you can see, it's time to fill the containers. So you just pop the top off, like so, body wash. That ought to do it. Put your lid back on, snap that back on. And then you're gonna have to prime the pump. There's a little hole in the bottom where the gel or the shampoo will come out of. And uh, you just press this button. I notice if you press this and then hold your finger over the hole, and then press it, hold your finger over there, press it, hold your finger on the hole. That's how you prime it. And there we go. Shower gel. All right, let's put this container in here. Shower gel, next, shampoo. Snap this in, well, we'll prime it first. So guys, we got it, and uh, I think I'm happy to have these uh, wall mount dispensers again. Like I, like I told you, I had these in the past. It's been about five years ago in one of our last homes, but it's close, handy, next to your shower, and uh, I've managed to clean up these window sills. We had a bunch of bottles of shampoo, conditioners up there, and my wife's got hers right over here. So we're all set. So overall, I like the stylishness of these things and I would recommend them. They were easy to prime and uh, it holds two of them, uh, shampoo, conditioner, or shower gel. Guys, thanks again for tuning into my channel and watching another video. I will see you guys on the next one. You and I, we're always on the edge. We fight and make love at the same time. Would you break up just because I told you?